My name is Howard Grimberg, Senior in Computer Engineering with a minor in Business from Overland Park. I made a big list of companies I would like to work for after researching them and talking to people in the industry. Amazon happened to be one of the companies on the list and when I looked they were hiring interns. The application process begins with your usual submit your information, here's my resume, my cover letter. It's very important to have your resume structured well and you have the keywords. And if a recruiter likes what they see and thinks you're a potential candidate, they'll call you for a phone screen and the phone screen will ask you, what's your background, what, what are you doing in school, things of that sort. If you pass the phone screen, then you move on to at least at Amazon. For internships, they have two interviews, back to back, usually they're about an hour and a half long each. They're phone interviews with actual collaborative coding, so the person who's interviewing you can actually see what you're typing. I made a huge mistake on my interview with Google that I didn't practice, and that taught me that I actually should. Part of the reason why I think I got the Amazon internship is because I studied the kinds of questions I would ask read a few books on it and made sure I really knew my stuff going into it. So yes, you have to practice them. Technical interviews are thousand percent practice. And the interviewer stressed this numerous times that they don't care that you know a specific platform or that you know a specific programming language. They care about do you have the capability to pick things up? Can you understand the fundamentals well enough that you can pick up the actual platform things and say, oh, I remember seeing something like that in class. So ECS does a really good job of teaching you the fundamentals.